Hello everybody and welcome back to my channel. In this video, I'm going to show how to set the tight function of this piece so that the uh, tight represented on this watch is uh, according to the tight in your location. So before we need, uh, before we start to set the tight function, we need to know two key information. First is the longitude of your location and next is the uh, lunitidal interval hours and minutes. So uh, let's see how it goes. So for in order to set the height, you press the top left corner of the watch so that it goes into time, uh, time setting mode and press it again, then it's the longitude. So as I mentioned, we need to key in the longitude. Of course, uh, in my place, it's uh, 100 degree east. If it press, it's, uh, so I can increase and, de and decrease the value by pressing here. And then to shift to the location, I can press. This one I can change from east and west. Okay. And next will be, after this one, uh, we press this, will be the interval hours. And once you're done with it, uh, will be the interval minutes. Okay. So once after you set all these uh, uh, values and you go back to the normal timekeeping, the tide will be according to your location. So let's go about how to get those uh, values. So with that, I will need to use my another old phone. Okay, I hope you don't mind. So the first thing that we need to go is to uh, go to this website. It's uh, lunitidal-interval.com okay so you scroll down so lunitidal interval the first thing is to set up the geolocation uh, first of course you need to let the the web page know where is your location of course you can just uh, click here to get your coordinate so uh, because i think i denied the the location so what you can do is uh, either to select your country and insert your postal code or if you look in Google map, you can actually find out the latitude and longitude of your location. So uh, for example, uh, my location, uh, it's roughly about, uh, I would try to key in, it's about 5.29. It's hard to operate the phone through another phone. So please bear with me. 5.29 okay and the lo uh, longitude is 100 that's what I've set in the watch as well but we will need this information to find the time interval okay so of course you uh, with that uh, you have to click got it so once I enter the information, you will more or less know where my location is. So I'm in Penang, Malaysia. My time zone is according to uh, Kuala Lumpur. Okay. So here we don't have any daylight saving time, but let's say if you have, uh, you can click that. And once you're done, you just click to calculate. So from here, uh, we will know your uh, new moon phase in transit. And here, what we need to do here is to uh, insert the time of the following high tide. Okay, so here is to consult a tide table. So uh, basically what you can do is try to Google, you know, the tide table of your location. So from here, in a tide table for your geolocation, search the high tide following the 13, 37 hours of the day, 8th of November, 2018. So from here, you, you can Google for your tight table of your location. For, for mine, uh, actually, I did that. Uh, so it has to be November 11th. Oh, no. Let me just double confirm again. No, nope, November the 8th. So I have to look for the uh, next tight interval on November the 8th after 13, 33, 37. So 13 hours, it's about uh, uh, one, uh, 13 hours is actually 1 p.m. So the next high tide for 8th of November is on 2.51 p.m. Okay, so high tide, you can see. So from here, it, so from here, click back. 
So you key in the next high tide hour. So 2 is uh, 2 p.m. is 14. Oops. scroll here okay so once you have this press click so you will have your loony tidal interval it's uh, around 114 okay so with that you can set this value inside the watch it's 114 so uh, I'm gonna set mine because I think it's slightly off and sometimes uh, you will have to reset it again so press this. So my longitude is 100 east. Oops, missed that. Okay, so I have to cycle through 100 east. So it's 1, 14. So I need to drop this to 14. Okay, so I'm done. So basically, as you can see, the minutes, it doesn't really change a lot because uh, this is just an estimation on the tide. Because just now at 133 interval, the tide height remains the same as 114. So that's it for this video. Uh, I hope that uh, this will help you to set a proper tide on your watch. And uh, please don't so forget to subscribe to my channel if you're new to this. It, will, it really helps me a lot. And as usual, don't forget to subscribe or follow me on my Instagram at gfw underscore watch. That's it for this video. Bye-bye.